So I have a confession to make. I did not move myself or my family of five to Panama. Somebody else did it, okay? Somebody else made me wealthy or rich or whatever you want to call it. And on this piece of paper today, I'm going to show you how to use somebody else or something else to make you wealthy or what you like to call yourself rich. There are two things I'm going to show you today. Very simple. I didn't say it was easy. I said it was simple. So you've been lied to by a lot of the greats. I might have to name drop a few of them today. Uh, and I was lied to, uh, you know, from them as well. But it's okay. We're going to get straight to it from this paper right here. So the number one thing you can do to leverage others to make you so-called rich or wealthy is to own assets. Let me get the marker. All right. So you want to own assets. And when I say own assets, I don't mean that you have to build them yourself, okay? You prove a market, make sure there's a demand, right? And then you create the supply. So what I mean by that is after you do your market research and realize there's an audience with a pain point or some type of pleasure they're trying to get to, then you can even acquire, partner with, or have somebody else build these assets, okay? So some of those assets can be that you might have heard of, real estate, all right? So we already know real estate creates billionaires, okay? But then in my asset empire, we have digital assets. Uh, what kind of digital assets? Well, I'm glad you asked. <laughs> we have affiliate networks, niche affiliate networks, sort of like a Max Bounty. You'll own your own like Max Bounty or ClickBank. We have online business directories, so similar to like a Yelp or Home Advisor, Angie's List. We have social networks, like a niche social network, like a LinkedIn or a Facebook type of situation, and we monetize these assets. Now watch this. So we got apps. Make sure you guys are staying for this. I ain't gonna beg you, but stay. All right, sites. All right, so now what is the next part of this? The next part of this, we're gonna switch up the color. We're gonna go to blue. The next part is leveraging others. One of my favorite things to do. Like I said, I didn't get myself out here. All praises to the most high God, other people got me out here because I did step one. I proved markets. Some of you guys have been customers or clients of me. I've been doing this since 2015. If you go and check my channel, right? So I've created assets, websites, apps, Courses. Courses are assets that are able to help people. And right now we have the asset empire that is allowing people to have their own assets and monetize them. So I did step one and then I leveraged others to help me get to where I need to be the same way you are supposed to because there are formulas. So we leverage others. So Microsoft did not get there by itself. Bill Gates do not know how to freaking market or advertise. Tesla did not get there by itself. Warren Buffett did not get there by itself. Jeff Bezos, none of them are out here doing their own freaking SEO. They're leveraging others. And let me give you two things that the major corporations and businesses have that you might not have that I'm gonna spend all my time, money, and dedication and breath of life building in 2023 and beyond. So I'm about to get that for you right now. A, the letter A, is affiliates. All right, so A is affiliates. All right, do you guys, do you guys have an affiliate program for your business or product? Do you have a referral program? Or are you just the only one running ads? And then you gotta keep cutting the ads off when you run out of money and all of that so your business has a bottleneck and never has a chance to grow. You need affiliates. If you've proven a market and you're getting sales, that means you have something valuable. So how come you haven't started putting the pressure, the stress on somebody else and creating opportunities and jobs, right? Well, I don't, you know, affiliates, right? Okay, so affiliates is a person that might not want to build their own business. Some people are like that. 
but they want to make money from home, so they'll use their time, efforts, skills, networks, all of that stuff to bring you sales to your products and services. The big boys understand that. How come you guys aren't doing it? This is what we teach in the Asset Empire, okay? So next is B. So we got B. B is joint venture partnerships and mergers. So sometimes you'll like acquire a business that can like speed up your growth or something like that. Maybe you'll partner with somebody, do some type of joint venture partnership or something if it will help you grow at a faster pace. So a lot of businesses do that. You'll see that they're under new management or something like that, but they still have the same operations or the same systems and stuff. That's why they do it, to grow faster, okay? Now, we have C. So we put joint JVs right there for D. So now what is C? C is internships, AKA free labor, AKA what we used to do on a plantation, AKA what we did to build up Egypt, okay? <laughs> so that's proof right there, if you know what I'm talking about, that that works. If you want to grow something, this is the greatest nation right now that you guys live in. And Egypt was the greatest nation. Both of those employed us, or without pay, us to build up their nations. Nowadays, in modern times, you would call that an unpaid internship, where you leverage a numerous amount of people to do work for free to bring you prosperity, okay? And then you might have the hope that you'll hire one. You guys saw, uh, uh, what is it called? Pursuit of happiness, right? Pursuit of happiness, it was a room of 60 people. Even on uh, Wolf of Wall Street, I think, right? But they had a room of 60 people. None of them get paid, okay? And it's one job that they're hiring for at the end of six months. So for an entire six months, people are coming in there looking good with their suits and everything like that. And they're cold calling and closing multi-million dollar deals every single day for free for this company. And then all they have to do at the end of their internship is hire one. Using the money that all of them made for that company. All right? This is how you grow. This is how you uh, uh, scale way past what you thought imaginable. You understand? These formulas right here, you let others build the wealth for you to where you can't even spend it in this generation. And this is what I'm dedicating everything to this year. So I'm praying that you guys will join me in that journey. We have uh, changed the asset empire to 10K. So if you're not afraid of that, I would strongly suggest that you get into the asset empire where we're going to help you with monetized assets, at least three to five of them. All right, and then you'll be able to leverage others to grow those for passive income, massive passive income if you do it right. All right, love you guys.